everyone, welcome back to the Integrity Botanicals YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be discussing a new product release from Ritual Defee, our favorite, and that is going to be the Color Nectar Pigment Balms. I mean, that name alone is just gorgeous. I'm of course sporting it on my face today. We'll get into all of the details. Um, but they look a little something like this. So if you're familiar with Ritual Defeat in general, um, all of their compacts are these kind of like black discs that are really beautiful, say the name on the front and the shade name on the back as well. For size comparison, these are quite a bit smaller than the cream pigments that already exist in the line, um, but product-wise they're fairly similar. So you get 3.2 grams worth of product in the Color Nectar Pigment Balms and you get 3.8 grams worth of product in the Inner Glow Cream pigments. So these are 24 bucks each and essentially they are these perfectly translucent yet stunningly vibrant um, jelly textured creams that can be used anywhere on the face. So that goes for eyes, cheeks, lips, the whole bit, get creative. The imagery that they have for um, the promotions for this item. They did some really out there gorgeous makeup as they always do. I did a little bit more pared down today. So I am wearing it on my cheeks. I'm wearing one of the shades here on my lips as well. And I am also wearing the shade I'm wearing on my cheeks in my crease and underneath my eyes as well. But we will get there. So in comparison to the color cream pigments or the, the cream pigments, what am I? the Inner Glow Cream Pigments. Um, these are a lot more gelatinous in texture. So they get really immediately emollient. They look really, really dark in the pan, but then when you swatch them, you'll see that there is that really beautiful jelly-like texture that they're describing. And this is so great because they do deposit quite a bit of pigment, but they blend out beautifully and really give you that watercolor effect that I think looks so stunning. It's easy to use. It's very, very approachable. Even though these are deeper shades, you really have a lot of flexibility because they're so buildable, but they have a lot of color. They're not sheer. You're not really going to have to work hard to build these up. So let's just jump right into the colors here and then I will discuss a little bit more. So first and foremost, my favorite, I think it is absolutely going to be a favorite of everyone, is the shade Bee Sting. And Bee Sting, they describe as a freshly pinched pink and it's absolutely that. So really beautiful emollient texture like I said. That's what I have on my cheeks and my eyes here today. Blends so beautifully and though that they have a more emollient finish, they still have a really nice dry down to them. That is not quite as matte as the cream pigments but definitely mattifies especially when it's blended out. Um, but you can see on my cheeks today I'm not wearing a highlight and it is still giving me a glow but it's not sticky or tacky which I sort of feared when I first touched these products. They feel like the RMS lip shines or really any of the RMS potted products but the dry down of them is a lot thinner and I feel like just more user friendly and better for all skin types which I really enjoy. So this color is gorgeous. It's a really true vibrant warm pink that I just cannot get enough of. It blended really really nicely on the eyes. You do need to take a little bit of time to build that color up on the eyes however but on the cheeks you just go and it's ready to go. Next up, we have the shade Bloodflower, and Bloodflower is described as a cherry red glaze. I have a little bit of Bloodflower kind of in my lower lash line here, and my upper lash line, I mean, kind of smudged in. I did a little bit of the next one as well. It's kind of a combo of the two, and this is the one that I also have on my lips. So this is a cherry red glaze, like I said. It is exactly that. Very true red, not overly bright, poppy neon. Again, this is a really good red for those of you who want to dip your toes into the red waters. Um, but this is really great because you can use it so many different places that even if you don't love the shade for your lips, very possible you will love this for your cheeks and your eyes. These colors tend to look specifically gorgeous in the winter months because red tones can really give a very, very natural flush to the cheeks as well. 
The final shade that we carry is the shade Glass Wing. And this one, when you open it up, you're like, oh, she dark. But when you swatch it, it's a beautiful grape jelly shade. So it has a lot more purple to it. Still a little bit red, definitely in that more burgundy family. And again, for the winter months, this is so gorgeous on a deep skin. This is beautiful. And again, I did help sort of accentuate the eyes with this product as well, which I really, really enjoy. So in conclusion, they are just very easy to use multi-purpose products. I think they wear nicely on the skin as well. My favorite places to use them are the cheeks and the eyes. The lips, I actually like to put a little bit of a lip balm down first because they have that dry down that I told you about. Um, they can be, they don't stay very cushiony soft, which a color like this, that is something I prefer. So I just do a layer of lip balm, pop this on, and that's how I get the best results. But on the cheeks and the eyes, beautiful buildable, very, very, very wearable despite um, their more um, intimidating look here in the pan. So these are new from Ritual Defi, the Color Nectar Pigment Balms, another winner. Um, I will compare these um, to the cream pigments in a dedicated video if you want to see that. But for the time being, the cream pigments um, are much more rich in texture. They're more of a matte finish as well. These are much more sheer, buildable, and maybe a little bit more approachable for you as well. So, new from Ritual Defi. I will have a swatch photo down below like I always do. I will have a direct, direct link to this product, and I will also have a full ingredients for you all as well so you could check it out. But if you like, the, if you like this video, if you're excited about this new release, please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe. I upload new videos here twice weekly. I don't want you guys to miss them, but thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for the continued love and support. Any questions, comments, concerns you may have, let me know in the comment section down below. Check us out on social media, do all of that good stuff, and I will catch you guys in my next one. Bye.